Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Monique and today I'm going to be doing a little review and try on of these magnetic lashes from Glamnetic. For those of you that do not know, I used to have eyelash extensions. I actually had them for over two years before quarantine and I loved my eyelash extensions, but then, you know, COVID hit and I haven't had them in almost a year now. So I'm super excited to be trying out these magnetic magnetic lashes today. I haven't tried out any before so I am a newbie and I really do not know what to expect. So I'm going to be covering all topics of these lashes today. I'm going to be going over the pricing, the application, how well they wear, and just everything. So first let's try to apply these eyelashes and kind of see what we're working with and then I will get into the pricing and all of that information. Alright so I am going to pull out my mirror. Glamnetic has tons of different eyelashes to choose from on their website. They have a variety of lengths, they have a variety of shapes, and they actually have this cool little quiz on their website where you can go in there and fill out your eye shape and your desired length and all that information and then they will kind of recommend lashes to you that they think that you would like and I think that is super helpful and a great tool if you don't really know what kind of lashes you do like. They also have vegan and mink eyelashes which I also think is pretty cool. So both of the eyelashes that I decided to try out are vegan and I got them both in a medium length. So this one is the Vixen. These ones look a little bit more wispy to me and then the other ones that I picked up are the VIP. First want to try out the VIP and then I will try out the Vixen because I have a feeling I'm gonna like the wispy ones better. Alright so I did decide to move you a little bit closer while I'm doing the application and Glamnetic also does have a lot of different magnetic liners on their website. They have different colors and different styles. I have the liquid one so that's that is what I'm going to be using today and it is in the shade Black Magic. So I already did my makeup as you can tell, I already did my everything and I probably should have put this on before I did my mascara but I don't know, I guess I forgot. So I'm going to just put this on as normal. Ooh. I am not the best with liquid eyeliner so we'll see how I do. Alright, so my liner is on and it is a little thicker than I typically like my liner to be but like I said I am not a pro with this style of liner but it honestly is like a pretty good eyeliner I think and it is very bold and black so it does say to make sure that you make the line as thick as the line on the lashes so I guess that it is a pretty good thing that I made it a little thicker. <laughs> So the next thing that it says to do is to measure the lashes. But these look like they're a pretty good fit for my eye, so I'm not going to do any cutting or anything like that, but you definitely could and should do that before you put on the liner if you think that you are going to need that. So now I'm just gonna pop them on and we'll see. One eye down. All right, I have them both on now. They are very glamorous, I feel like. Give you an up close view. So these lashes are the medium length and I do think that they are a little long for a medium length. I would definitely classify this as like a longer length, but that might just be me and my lash preference. I do think that they are very pretty. I probably would wear these more if I was going to be like going out at night or on a date or a dinner or something a little bit more fancy when I'm gonna have like more of a full face of makeup on just because I do feel like they're very like oomph if that makes sense. They were super easy to apply. I can't even believe it, but when I was in high school, I would spend so much time like for prom stressing over putting on like those 
glue eyelashes and to this day I will not even try to put them on because I just get so frustrated and give up so quickly but these ones were so so easy to apply I am honestly amazed I put the liner on and they easily just snapped right on and into place and I do I mean obviously they do not look natural they you can tell that I have falsies on but I do think that they are very pretty and they feel comfortable but all right now I'm going to try the ones that are a little bit more wispy I'm super excited to try these ones because they were the ones that I was most attracted to and when I used to get eyelash extensions I would always go for that wispy look so on the back of the, your eyelashes it actually does have an application instruction so it does say to remove to just gently peel them off and then these are reusable so you just want to make sure that like the magnet strip on the back of the lashes are clean and that they don't have any dried liner on them and then you can just put them back in here and store them so it does say to make sure not to get them wet the instructions are very clear on the back they do have more information listed on their website if you need more application tips so i'm just going to gently peel them off like it said Here you can see the difference. <laughs> All right, I just reapplied some fresh magnetic liner and now let's try the wispy ones. I do know that a lot of people prefer to put lashes on with tweezers, but I am not good with tweezers, so I'm just using my hands. Okay, I really do like these wispy ones. I think that they are so, so pretty and fun. I did have a little bit of trouble putting it on this eye, as you can see, but other than that, I think that they look pretty good. And they were, again, super easy to apply. I think these are so cute and flirty and fun. Like, I really, really like the look of these ones. I did like the look of the other ones, but these ones are definitely my favorite. And I honestly think that they look perfect with this little flirty and fun outfit that I have on. Overall, these lashes were super, super easy to apply. And I definitely recommend trying these magnetic lashes versus ones that you have to apply with, like, adhesive or glue, just because these ones were so so much quicker and easier to apply they feel like super high quality i think that they look so cute but the one thing that i will say is that these are the medium length and i do feel like they're a little bit long for me but like i said earlier maybe i'm just like somebody that's a little bit uh, more modest i guess with my eyelash length so i think that when i pick these up again i will definitely get the short length but other than that, I really, really like them. I think both the styles were super pretty that I tried. And they do have a lot of different styles on their websites that I'm interested in trying as well. Like I said, I have never tried magnetic lashes before. So I don't know how well these compare to other magnetic lashes. But I do know that I think they are so, so easy and convenient and way better than the lashes that you would just pick up at Target or something like that. Okay, so now let's get into the pricing. So they do have value kits that you can purchase on their website that come with a couple pair of lashes or else they do have some that come with more than two pair, but the value kits that I'm referring to come with two pair of lashes and a magnetic lash liner. Right now on their website, I think that they are on sale for around $80. And I do think that is probably going to be your best bet when it comes to purchasing these lashes, just because if you decide to just purchase one pair of lashes by itself, it, it, it does look like they cost around $29.99. And you do have to buy the magnetic liner separately. So I do think that the value kits are your biggest bang for your buck when it comes to these. Glamnetic was nice enough to send me these lashes and they also provided me with a discount code if you guys are interested in picking up some of these lashes. You can use the code Monique, my name, for 15% off your order. So that will also help save you some money. I do know that these lashes are a little bit pricey, but based off my first impression, I do think that they are worth it if you are somebody that likes to wear falsies just because they are so, so 
easy to apply. I honestly cannot even get over it. And they feel super high quality, they look great, and they are reusable. So you will get bang for your buck out of these lashes. I love doing little reviews and trying out new products here on my channel. So leave a comment down below and tell me if you have any beauty products that I should review and test out. I've tried lots of different dry shampoo and like hair care products. So I've tried press on nails and now I tried magnetic eyelashes. If you like this style of video and you like seeing me testing out and trying new products like this, then also please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. I swear it really helps to let me know what kind of videos you are liking on my channel because I always want to make sure that I am providing content to you that you enjoy watching. I had so much fun trying out these lashes today and I definitely will be purchasing more magnetic lashes in the future. I will leave everything that I picked up down in the description box along with my discount code in case you do decide to purchase some of these for yourself. But other than that, thank you so so much for watching. Let me know what you think of these lashes and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.